Can I get your name and badge, please? Uh, why? Because I asked for it and you're a public servant. Did you're I required. detain you? You're required. No, I'm not. Upon detainment doesn't mean you, it's the only reason to identify. Anytime a citizen asks Is for identification. Yeah, I'd like your ID. Name and badge, please. No, I'm not providing that to you. You're I'm required. not detaining you. You have no reason to know my name and badge. Hey guys, welcome back. You're here today with Anthony X over in beautiful Los Gatos, California at Vasona Park. We're doing a quick audit of the Park and Recreations Department. Make sure to pound that like button. Make sure to follow or subscribe. Show your support guys by sharing this video. And as always, you know the drill, no boot licking. Let's do this guys. Nice little area, lots of trails. Beautiful guys. Right, we're gonna go right up the hill. What in cousin tarnation, hickory, smoke, hillbilly shit is this? Haven't seen a payphone for a long time. That should be in a museum. So as you can see, we're right next to the freeway guys, Highway 17 over in Los Gatos, California. Clara County Parks. All right, park Ranger. License plate 1566453. All right, so this is the administration department. Right over here, we got the maintenance yard. Got some parking down there. Got the reservoir over there. They have a little wharf down there, not a wharf, but a little pier. Pretty nice, lots of trails. The park is open, guys, with free parking. Swing on by. We all need to get out a little bit with everything going on. Definitely make sure you put your parking brake on if you're parking here, guys. Right, let's see, make sure there's no contraband, no beer bottles. Just got some Starbucks, not a big deal. Let's see what's in here. Kind of hard to see with the glare. Maybe some coffee or something. That's all right. Let's make sure there's no contraband in this vehicle. Looks okay, guys. So it says employee parking only. As you can see, we're right off the little road here where you can drive. There is a sign that says maintenance yard, employees only. So I'm assuming they mean the yard behind the gate because if you look over there, there's a sign that says, do not enter official vehicles only, authorized personnel only with the penal code. But that's not posted over here. That's kind of insinuating it's beyond that fence. Or else that sign would have been over here. They don't seem to mind. They're just chatting amongst themselves and kind of laughing and smiling. That's how it should be, guys. Hello. Hello. There you go. How's it going, brother? That's how it should be. This guy waved hi to us. Got another unmarked unit. Kind of odd. Question, how come your unit's not marked? Was that? No, I'm just wondering what, what department? Are you with the Park and Recreations or a sheriff or? I'm, no, I'm, your, your vehicle's not marked, but it's paid by our taxes. I'm just wondering who you're with. If you want to interview me, I can talk to you if you'd like. 
Yeah, absolutely. Come on over. How are you? Come on over. Let's talk. I'm, I'm good. Well, well, you just you just you, want, you just volunteered. I don't want to get run over. You don't, you don't have to. No. So my question then is, once again, I'm just wondering what vehicle this is. It's a it's a. Is it a Got, so like a ranger is it like the same as a ranger or? it is a ranger i'm a captain gotcha so i'm just wondering because i don't think it's up to code not having anything marked uh, i disagree but that's fine you don't have to just imagine if it was your daughter I'm your not, your wife not in your, shoes. your daughter your wife I answered your, question your, your daughter your wife was out there and let's say they get pulled over with a vehicle that's not marked that could be dangerous no, no it won't be dangerous <laughs> You can look up the vehicle code all you want. Oh well, yeah, I'm just curious. I'm like I'm not an expert. I was that's, curious. That's not true. That's it, not what you're asking. Is it about being curious? You're saying it's out of code. So if you want to look it up, you go ahead. And do no, that. I said I think it's out of code. Is, that's but that's not curious. But you're not sure either. Can you get your name and badge, please? Uh, why? Because I asked for it. You're a public servant. You're required. You? You're required. No, I'm not. Upon detainment doesn't mean you, it's the only reason to identify. Anytime a citizen asks is for identification, else? yeah, I'd like your ID. Name and badge, please. No, I'm not providing that to you. You're I'm required. not detaining you. You have no reason to know my name and badge. Is there anything else? You're dismissed. I'm dismissed? You're dismissed, brother. Interesting. So this was an interview? You're dismissed. Are you conducting interviews? You're dismissed. Okay. Have a great day. You too. Appreciate it. Oh, yeah, I was already over there. Okay. Take care, brother. Be safe. Thank you for not identifying. Let's make sure, guys, that he doesn't have any contraband in there. No beer bottles. Oh, yeah, I already dismissed you. I'm just uh, observing now. Well, you offered to pull over, then you declined afterwards. Come on. No, I didn't. I got it recorded, brother. No, I didn't decline. And you're you breaking your employee policy you manual. I, your employee policy you manual requires you to identify in a courtesy manner. Yeah. You've already broke that policy. Yeah, that's not a policy. It actually is a policy. I challenge you on that. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Tell you what, can, let's do a friendly bet. If I'm right, you apologize on camera. If I'm wrong, I wash your car. How about that? I'm not making a bet with you. I bet you'd lose. Is there anything else? I already dismissed you. Then, then what are you doing? I'm recording you. It's obvious, brother. Okay, for what? I choose to. Okay. Anytime I come across a law enforcement. If you, a, if you have a question, I'll answer it for you. You don't. I asked you your name and badge. You refused. Yeah. Is there anything else? You don't deserve those stripes on your arm. Okay. That's fine. That's your opinion. So no, that's the. That's a opinion. fact, brother. Okay. No, that's your. Sir, opinion. I'm keep your hands out of your pocket. I need to be able to see your hands at all time. No, you're not a peace officer. That's ridiculous. No all right. Well. You to talk my to hands you. going into my pocket too. Okay. Is there anything else? I dismissed you already. That you, wasn't you already that refused. No? You're, dis no? you're dismissed. No. Is that a no? You're dismissed. Okay, so nothing else. You're dismissed. Have a good day. You got it. Next time a citizen approaches you, though, try to be professional and identify. Unreal, guys. Did you see that? This guy does not like his job. Excuse me. Had a question. If you got a moment. I know you're busy. Just had a couple quick questions. And I do appreciate you being cordial over there and saying hi. That's what it's all about. You know, communication with the community. Yeah, um, How's it going, brother? So I'm out here just working on a story. Obviously, I can't disclose what it is at the moment or would jeopardize it. Mm -hmm. But I had a, two questions. Is Number one, your opinion, is it your policy to identify when a citizen requests? I think it's like you know your badge number, I your name. I do. Yeah, I don't but, think there's anything wrong with it. But it's a policy, correct? Yeah, why? Why would you not? Why? Why would you not? Name and badge, please. No, I'm not providing that to you. Not... Why? Why would you not? Yeah, exactly. That's my thought exactly. Right. Because so the gentleman that came out of this vehicle, mm -hmm. he was very unprofessional. To me, it seems like it was unnecessary. He told me straight out, he's not required to identify. Yeah. I am going to look it up. I would like you to, you know, maybe he'll listen to you when you go in there. Let him know I'm not out here to cause trouble. Yeah. I was hey, trying. You're a First Amendment auditor, right? 
Exactly. You know what? What's your YouTube? I think I've seen your YouTube. You might have. Yeah, you know, which one is it? If you don't mind me asking. You know, I usually don't disclose that information, but I'll let you know. You're being cordial. It's Anthony X First Amendment Audits. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've seen a couple of those. That's on YouTube or AX First Amendment Audits on Facebook. Uh -huh. Law enforcement in general, we need to be able to know that you guys are going to do everything by the book. It's not about right. the feelings. Yeah. You got to be biased. You got to just, you know, uphold the oath, the Constitution. Yeah. Yeah. But I would like to, you know, try to build that bridge you know between the community law enforcement especially park rangers man come on you guys are out here making sure everyone's having fun enjoying the, the beautiful scenery the trees mm -hmm. you know and to have something as so simple as identifying or just answering a basic 10 second question yeah. i shouldn't have had to be out here for an hour waiting for someone else right. you know yeah. on there if you would have just simply said like i said you know his name his badge when i asked answered a few questions just been like oh you know i'm not sure you know about the policy but i'll look into it yeah. that's all he had to say or hey here's a number you can call it if you'd like here's our website mm -hmm. that's a great question sure. yeah. and the biggest part if he's not willing to identify as a public servant mm -hmm. that's kind of iffy to me yeah. you know so i don't you know i know you can't say anything bad about your brothers and sisters but we should all be brothers and sisters right. it shouldn't be like just because you have a badge mm -hmm. at the end of the day we all bleed the same color right, right. you know so anyways i appreciate your professionalism yeah, yeah, and uh do you, what, Anthony what X. Anthony uh, X first them. Cool, so. and like I said you know there's other auditors out there that they're about antagonizing mm -hmm. they're about trying to create conflict right I'd rather have 10 boring videos than yeah. one exciting video because that means that the bridge is being built yeah. so like I said I'm not here to antagonize however the other gentleman in there I call him gentleman he was no gentleman mm -hmm. I did have to you know get a little rowdy with him just because he wouldn't identify it wasn't a hard request and when i asked him about the vehicle like i said it's very simple yeah. so i could talk to your ears bleed brother yeah. i appreciate your time yeah, you know like i said like i said you know just let him know that you know next time a citizen approaches and asks for the identification yeah. hey i'm so-and-so with the parks and recreations here's my bat hey do you want a business card you know mm -hmm. something you know yeah. you know just be professional and if a citizen asks a question about one of their vehicles i mean come on when you're growing up didn't you want to be a cop or a fireman we don't want our kids watching these videos yeah, sure. and thinking that's the last thing I want to be now. Mm -hmm. You know, we yeah. want to have a great, you know, rapport, yeah. you know, on there. And that's not a way he was, the way he was behaving. Hopefully he's just having a bad day. Hopefully that's not, I'm, I'm going to be optimistic. Hopefully that's just a bad day. Yeah. I'm hoping, I'm crossing my fingers, knocking on wood. Hopefully that's not how he normally acts, yeah. you know. So if, for the record, just again, I'm, because I've been talking forever. Sure. Uh, what was your name and badge again? It's Ranger Demore badge, P-Fall 120. Gotcha. Appreciate it. Take care. All right, Anthony. Take care, man. All right. All right, guys. Thanks for checking out my latest audit over here at Park and Recreations in Los Gatos, California. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Pass or fail. You be the judge. Let me know. Make sure to pound that like button. Make sure to follow or subscribe. Make sure to share these videos. And as always, guys, you know the drill. No boot licking. We'll see you on the next one.